Welcome back. In today's update for October 4th, 2024, we're diving into the recent shifts in the global coal market, influenced by geopolitical tensions, weather patterns, and market dynamics. Let's get started. Early October has seen significant volatility in the coal market, driven by ongoing geopolitical events, particularly the Israel strikes. These tensions have reverberated through energy markets, including coal. Additionally, the anticipated La Nina phenomenon is expected to create colder-than-usual temperatures, increasing heating demand, especially in Europe. With supply chain disruptions from key exporters like South Africa and Indonesia, prices have been fluctuating dramatically. In Europe, thermal coal prices have continued to rise, hitting $116 to $117 per tonne. This increase is primarily due to limited stockpiles and unexpectedly cold weather forecasts, which are pushing coal's role in power generation higher as natural gas prices spike. Compounding the situation, Colombian coal shipments to Europe have decreased by 20% week on week, tightening the market further. Buyers are scrambling to secure contracts at higher prices to ensure future deliveries. The UK recently closed its last coal-fired power plant, marking a significant step towards cleaner energy. However, its impact on the global coal market remains minimal. The UK has been phasing out coal for years, and its consumption is dwarfed by major coal users like China and India, which continue to drive global market trends. Meanwhile, gas prices in Europe have surged to $442.97 per 1,000 cubic meters, despite higher underground gas storage levels. Ongoing geopolitical tensions and forecasts for colder temperatures are pushing demand higher. As coal stocks remain low, energy markets in Europe are likely to face more volatility as winter approaches. Turning to the South African coal market, prices for high calorific value coal have risen to $106 to $108 per tonne, largely driven by European demand. However, some trades are showing discounts, indicating a disconnect between physical and exchange-based coal prices. In Indonesia, mixed movements are observed, with the 5,900 GAR grade stable at $92 per tonne, while lower calorific coal prices have dropped due to high supply and weak demand from India. In China, coal prices remained stable at $124 per tonne during the Golden Week holiday. Although trading slowed during this period, there's optimism for future price support due to colder temperatures and government stimulus measures designed to boost economic activity. Australian high calorific value coal prices have climbed to $140 to $142 per tonne, spurred by demand in the Asia-Pacific region and China's economic stimulus. However, the Australian government has revised its thermal coal export forecast for 2025 downward, raising concerns about potential disruptions due to La Nina. The metallurgical coal market, especially hard coking coal, has seen prices surpass the $200 mark, driven by China's demand for steel production. Yet, Indian buyers are cautious about rising prices, indicating a complex interplay between supply and demand. Lastly, a tragic accident at the Oakey Creek mine in Australia has led to a temporary shutdown, raising safety concerns in the industry. This disruption may lead to short-term supply constraints, affecting the metallurgical coal market and prompting discussions about workplace safety in mining. As we look ahead, the global coal market remains in a state of flux, influenced by geopolitical events, weather patterns, and demand fluctuations. While European prices rise and Asia adjusts to post-holiday conditions, understanding these trends is crucial for navigating the complexities 
of the coal market. Thanks for tuning in. If you found this update helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more insights into the energy market. See you next time.